So picture in your mind's eye an economist. What do you see them doing? What do you think they work on? If you ask most people in surveys or you go out on the street, people mostly associate economics with money or finance. And of course, you know, economists do study those things. But we do a lot more. If you're interested in climate change, in inequality, unemployment, corruption, gender issues, alcoholism, these are all things that economists are studying. In my own work, I've studied questions of poverty in Bangladesh, of how you can make people pay their taxes, and how you can tackle climate change without hurting the poor. If you're interested in understanding the world around you and in thinking about how you can change it, then economics is a subject you should consider. Economists also don't spend all day sitting around in their ivory tower just thinking about things. They go out into the world. You see them working in urban slums in Addis Ababa. They go into the archives for the Latvian KGB to understand the history of what people were doing. They even go into tax offices. That doesn't sound exciting, but it's more fun than you think. They really try to understand what actually happens in the world around them. Economists are, of course, found in academia, like me. They're also found in government, thinking about how to design policies to help the poor. They're also found in companies like Google, who are a huge hire of economists to try to think about the best way to target ads. They're seen in all kinds of industries, doing all kinds of interesting things. Within the UK, Warwick was one of the first departments to take mathematics seriously and really build that into the way we teach our economics. But at the same time, we've never lost sight of the key issues. Warwick also has a reputation for having a strong element of history, thinking about how the economy has evolved, thinking about what we can learn from the past to understand the present. We also have politics deeply embedded in our economic syllabus, so that whenever we're thinking about what policy changes we all want to have because they say good for climate change, we also think about what the barriers are and how we can overcome them. It also even thinks about issues like happiness and well-being, going beyond simply thinking that money is the measure of what we need people to have. So economics at Warwick takes a really broad and diverse perspective. A key part of our mission is getting the word out there, because it's only by doing that that we can change the world.